What up guys, it's your boy Carl Hugh here, how you all doing? Welcome to Sunday Rant, Sunday Rant, episode 5. This bloody pandemic is doing my nutting. Right, I've been in since Tuesday. I managed to go out yesterday for a couple of hours because there was a few essential items we needed for the house. So I ventured out, only for a couple of hours. And it was like people were everywhere. Grab this, grab that, grab this, grab that. Went into Herons to get a few bits. Empty shelves, empty shelves. We needed some hand sanitizer. You know, not the ones where you just spray it and rub it in. But we needed some hand wash. Went in to um, Late Night Pharmacy. Oh yeah, we've got some Carex. 4 99 a bottle. I was like, sod that out. Paying a fiver when you can normally get it for two quid. So we walked around a bit and went into body care and looked. All their hand wash was empty, but they did have some bars of soap left. So we got a pack of three because there's three of us here. And we've each got a bar of soap each and we've got our names on the boxes so we don't cross-contaminate soaps and that. But we tried to get other essential items. We managed to get a few bits that we needed. Not a great lot because everyone's just buying and buying and buying and buying. What for? It affects the throat and the chest. It doesn't affect your ass. So I don't know why you're stocking up on the toilet roll for. What are you going to do? Eat the toilet roll if you've run out of food? I don't think so. They should bring back the Isaac toilet roll from many years ago. Then you wouldn't panic buy on toilet roll, would you? Because you wouldn't want to use that. No, but it's just peeing me off. But I just want to say to everyone, stay safe in this time. I have got to go out again on Tuesday because I've got a doctor's appointment. It's been pre-booked months in advance. So I'm just going to go there, go to Tesco's, get my money up because apparently there will be problems soon with the banks. So I want to withdraw my money so I know I've got it safe at home. I've got to be careful what with having uh, asthma and lung conditions. So I've just got to be careful. I'm going to go and see if they've got a rescue pack. Because apparently on Facebook, they're saying that you can get a rescue pack where you get um, five days worth of prednisolone, how we pronounce it, um, antibiotics and um, two other things as well for if you get chest problems. So I'm going to see if they've got any of them available because I've got asthma, obviously. And then, But most of the time since I've been in, I've just been playing on my games and sleeping, really. Um, it just passes the time, passes the day, gets me a couple of games completed, which is really good, and that, so yeah, uh, just stay safe, I just want to say a big, big thank you to all the NHS staff, and all the carers around the UK, and all the other parts of the world, thank you for the wonderful job you're doing, thank you for still going out to work in this time of uncertainty, and helping those less fortunate it is much, much appreciated. I just want to give a big shout out to my cousin Sophie. She works for the NHS and she works at the hospital in Bristol. And she's been doing a fantastic job. So I just want to say thank you, Sophie, for all the hard work you're doing. It's much appreciated. So if you're new to the channel, don't forget to hit that subscribe button. Don't forget to, get to hit the bell notification if you want to know when I next upload. And I'll see you later.